Hello friends, Mari Smith here. I wanted to draw your attention to some strange activity that you might see on a private message on your page or maybe on a wall. These are coming from uh, fake accounts. This is an example on one of my clients' pages. Got the screenshot and uh, the profile is like the Facebook blue padlock. The message says, we have received many reports from your fan page. Please review your page and your post for reasons that you violate our terms. If you think it's a mistake, verify your page in the link below. And it gives you this weird link, which you can see is like a big long number.com. There is no way that that is a Facebook URL. And, you know, trying to sign it off of Facebook support, uh, definitely not accurate. Now, uh, as of time of the screenshot, which was early this morning, uh, this profile, this is a screenshot of it right here. Uh, it has actually been removed, thankfully. It's a brand new profile, as you can see, with nothing on it. No cover image, no pose, no nothing. Fake profile, right? Uh, but let me see. My friend Pam Brossman, she posted uh, earlier today this rather concerning message. She'd seen something similar. Has anyone received messages from this person telling people their account will be terminated? I seem to go and grab people's accounts and send them a message. So whether it's the same party uh, as the other message we saw or not, well, it could be the same people behind it, but this page is still active. Notify ads maintenance. I mean, secure. I mean, good grief. So we click on that and you can see, actually, I've got it open here already. Um, this is still uh, an active page. Um, you know, I see like, two hours ago and they're sharing other people's posts, page posts. And with this little warning, your account will be disabled, so on and so forth. They're trying to get you to fo uh, force you to click on this link. You know, it's phishing. P-H-I-S-H-I-N-G, phishing. They're trying to hack into all of these different accounts. And so my advice, my friends, first of all, got to use common sense, okay? Never, never, never click on a long-winded link like that. Maintenance-ads-publish2016.2mini.com. Hey, there's no way that's a Facebook URL, <laughs> right? Same as this one in the URL that we saw um, in the message, this long numbers.com bunch of numbers. Facebook are not going to do that. Always, if in doubt, you know, click inside of Facebook, not on the URL, but you could go and look at that profile. Or in this case here with Pam, drew my attention to this page. So what we want to do is, uh, you know, obviously ignore anything you see like that in terms of your own clicking on it. And in this case, I would actually click the wee three dots. You can do that on a profile or a page and report it, you know, and we got to tell uh, Facebook about these things. It's a scam. It shouldn't be on Facebook. Um, definitely a scam. Now, actually, depending on what you're up to, for me, um, right now I'm just going to report it. Uh, I tend to not block because I want to keep an eye on when Facebook takes it down. Although they'll usually they let you know in your little, um, you know, um, updates, reports, hide all. Well, that's bizarre. Some things you can try to do. Oh, I see. Back. Okay, so it's already reported. <sighs> Sigh. Facebook doesn't make things. <laughs> doesn't make things obvious. Oh, okay. And so um, here's some visitor posts. So someone else has actually uh, made a comment. I you going to scan. Be careful. Yeah. So folks, please be careful. This is a, a, a new thing. Seems to be doing the rounds. And let's be savvy and not uh, get caught with these weird phishing links and report them to Facebook. Okie doke. Stay safe out there.